This is Christmas in Knoxville. I'm in the Army at Oak Ridge. Bill is 13 months old. Behind him is Sunday the dog. Hi, Billy. Hi, Arlen. This is Sunday, our first dog. We've now moved to Yorktown Manor in Rhode Island. I'm back in graduate school at Brown University. This is March 1946. Again, is our dog in the background. Billy was very cautious going down steps. You'll see it later on also. He always got down way, way ahead of the step. units were built for the Navy at Quonset Point. The backyard is very rocky, as you can see from this. fun in the sand pile out behind the house. Notice the new coat that Billy has. It's now July. You'll see this coat many times on other family members. water many times again. Doesn't this look like fun? A nice hot summer play in the pool. Wow, that cold.
Brooklyn's are our neighbors. We're now looking up at Charlie's house in Champlain, New York, right at the U.S. border. There's a Canadian custom house. There's the American flag on the American side. This is our first vacation in September 1946. There's a Canadian flag. This is my, my grandfather, my father, Billy, and myself in St. Lambert, Quebec. There's the grandfather, Adcock. He came over to Canada, but in 1870, as a minister, and bringing the ministry to the colonies. He's buried in Noyen, Quebec. There's the four Adcocks. We're now going to visit Bramwell Heights' cousin, the Reverend Morrison, near Montreal. It's a beautiful lake near Montreal Island. There's Billy in the dark, myself. There's Ellen and Billy, the Reverend Morrison, and Grandma White, my mother Luella, and on her left is Aunt Viola, her sister. Now we're back in Yorktown Manor. It's September 1946. There's Billy and Sunday again. We have now moved to Browntown on Session Street in Providence, Rhode Island, which was university housing for graduate students. It's July 1947. Again, we're back on rocky soil. In the background is a gymnasium for Brown University. Children have a lot of fun in the dirt. There's a little neighbor. Brand new car for Billy. You'll see this car again as the paint ages. A little extra horsepower is required here to navigate these roads. <laughs> swing yard playground for the brown town. We had a lot of fun around these swings like this. Wow. Here's a, a slide right in the same playground. Whoops. <laughs> Go on, Billy. Go on, slide down the slide. Well, no, I don't want to do that, Daddy. Okay, come back down. Now, you remember Bobby is 10 days old. It's hard to see him here, but there he is in little crib.
Oh boy. Material. Isn't that fun? You're lagging the water. Wow, isn't that fun? <laughs> the Prince Albert and Can. We had an old empty swimming pool behind we used to play ball in. We'd bat it, and there comes the ball to get Billy. It used to be fun. self-contained place to play ball. There we are. I got you, Billy. I'm gonna get you. There we are. How's that for Eleanor? We're now on vacation on Salisbury Beach in Maine. That's water, that's the Atlantic Ocean. Okay, Billy, get in the water. There's this Prince Albert can again. Go on, get in the water. Go on, Billy. Go on. Hello. Go on, Billy. Oh, get me. <laughs> Bobby's in a basket on the up on the beach. You'll see it later on. It just flash by. There you go, Billy. Go in the water. He doesn't want to go there. Thing. Bobby's up there somewhere. Right there, right there's Bobby. Here, come on, let's go in the water. It's so nice. <laughs> oh, dear me. <laughs> okay, I'll take him in the water. Come on, take him in the water, Elmer. Ah, ah, here. Oops. Wow. <laughs> I'll stay and dry that. Oh, pretty little girl. That makes a difference. <laughs> there. Sit down in the water. <laughs> you have your water. This is winter in Freeport. Winter of 1947-48. I'm holding the camera upside down. We always made fun of this because it's very hard to hold a camera upside down. It's not the normal way, obviously. Done by mistake. That nice looking snow. We got stuck in New York and Grandma had to feed the two boys before we get back, which was very hard because Bobby was on breastfeeding, but Grandma somehow managed we had to spend the night in New York before we get back because such a big snow this winter. <laughs> there we are upside down the snow. Ah, oh, right side up. Look at the nice snow they have. Now we're back at downtown. Still in the snow banks up there in Providence. No. Huh. 
There we are. Keep warm. Got my army jacket on, my pipe. There's our little Bobby and Billy again. summer of 1948. <laughs> there we are. the grass. down the hills down there, up downtown, little slope. That's Billy the Acrobat. Oops. Oops. There we go. That's enough of that. Nice sidewalks. There's Bobby in his crib. My mother thought he'd never walk. Here again, we're in the pool at Brown Town. Doesn't it look nice there, that pool? Wow, look at the nice water. Oh, look at that. Our little neighbor's children, too. We call it Fertile, Val Fertile Valley. Everybody had children in this Brown Town area. This is one of our best investments, this pool. You'll see it all through the rest of the movie. <laughs> oh, hear me. Now we're on another vacation in Canada. That's Lucille, my sister. There's Bobby, there's Billy. This is up in Chisco Bay in September 1948. There's Mother in the boat behind her. There's Ben Lucille. Just 18 at this time. There's mother. Okay, sit down, Bobby. Now we move to Jones Beach near Freeport, New York. We're playing in the sand. Big sand hill. And then it's the Atlantic Ocean from Jones Beach. Wow, look at that water. <laughs> oh. sand pile they're going there now. Well, look at that 
sent it. Put the hole to the bottom there and the water comes in, the water will come inside the little cavern there. This is where Grandpa and Grandpa lived in Freeport, Long Island, 86 South Long Beach Avenue. There's Grandpa Goller with white hair. There's Grandpa Devon with no hair. There's there's Eleanor's father, Jack Goller. On the way on the left is Grandma Devon. Grandma, Grandma Goller. There's Billy. There's Grandma. Devlin, Jack, and his father, Grandpa Goller. <laughs> this is Freeport, September 1948, on vacation. I just graduated from Brown University. We're going to go on our way to Tulsa. And here we are in Tulsa. Here's Bobby wearing the same coat you saw Billy wearing earlier. This is now February 1949. Doing at 3335 South Yorktown Avenue. I'm now working at Stanland Oil and Gas. We moved into a new development. You can see all the houses being completed. Again, standing in the background. There's Bobby again. That's sweet little owner. There's little Eddie. Yeah, let's do something, Eddie. Laugh or something. now in Missouri. It's in September 1949. We're at the Riverside Court. There we are. Playing a little propeller game here. See how it goes? Try it, Billy. Wow.
see an airplane or something? I guess, and kind of bright sun. <laughs> Keto character. Are you going to smile or laugh or something? Yeah, there he is laughing at. in Canada, June 1950. We're back in Francisco Bay, which is near Clarenceville. There are the three children, that nice water up there. Oops. Very sandy bottom, very shallow water. My brother William on my left, and there's his little daughter Linda. There's my brother. There's my father, and my mother, and his and Bill's wife. There's little Linda. June 1950 from vacation. Now we're in Freeport on this plane 86 left Long Beach Avenue. There's Eddie. He's going to play ball too, I guess. Give him the ball, Billy. Bobby. Oh, I can't get a look. There we are. Back in Tulsa in September 1950. Stand up, Eddie. I'll get you. Oh, he's just starting to walk. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Hit a little Crosby car. All the houses are built up now. Ooh, still playing water hoses. Here, let me get that boy. I'll water him. <laughs> oh, no, you won't.
trying to host some more. Oh, well. Oh, look what I got. They were marching the backyard. Isn't that cute? <laughs> Okay, I'll put my coat, fix my hair, and we can all march. We got a nice rose garden there. This is October, roughly now, 1950. chickens that the Pickerings gave us. Okay, go back here and start from here, Eddie. water. I'm going to need a larger pool now. One month old. November 51, Eddie walking in the snowbanks. <laughs> wow, well, look at that snow.
is the March of 52, Peggy's baptismal day. There's Grandpa Dollar on the far right. There's Peggy. There's Jack Dollar. There's a <laughs> boy that our old Buick we had for years and years. <laughs> There's Grandma Dublin on the left. There's little Peggy now and all smiles. There we are. Our last baptism. Yeah, the blanket. There's Eddie mowing the lawn. That pretty good, did not it? That's Peggy in the stroller. Wow. It's now May of 52. Look at that hairdo. Eating the bugs out of the yard. Customer joining us. <laughs> Look at Daddy. Look at Daddy. Look at Daddy. Turn your head. There we are. Peggy's starting to walk now. This is May of 52. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Okay, I'll put both my hands. What are you doing? Eating something. There's Peggy. Come on, Peggy, get up and walk. Now we're all in the pool. You sure you do need a bigger pool now. and a tin cup and you got it made in a pool. What you gonna do, Billy? Oh. <laughs> now it's June of 53. How beautiful roses are and they're coming out beautifully.
isn't that the same coat there on Peggy? Is that little Crosby car? We're all in our Sunday clothes. We're now living at 3503 South Yorktown in Tulsa, just a little ways up the street. There's Buddy Reno, a neighbor. Billy, for the first time, has his own bedroom. certainly was a fantastic attraction. There you are, Billy. A little hose on you. moved to Dallas. Bobby's learned to ride his bicycle. We're living at 3937 Centenary. I'm now working for Texas Instruments. This is Christmas time, 1953. Yeah, up the street, up the street, Bobby. There's Eleanor practicing on the bicycle. She does pretty well, doesn't she? There's Eddie following. <laughs> Bobby's got it down. A little bit up. This is our swings out in the backyard. Our first house in Dallas. Again, we're playing the water.
There's the Alamo. taking a trip to Canada to visit Lucille and her children, Gower and Leah. There's my mother. There's Lucille on the left and her husband, Mac, behind my mother. There we are. I go to see my brother in Montreal. There's William and his family. And I am with a baby. Mother sitting down. There's William in the shorts. Short in front of William. Back in Dallas, off to work in the Causeway. He always rode out on the car to the street and all jumped off every morning. That was one of our routines, going to work. And here we go to work. Jump off. Goodbye, Daddy. Eddie's learned to ride the bicycle. Ah! Okay, Eddie, let's go again. Oops. No, no, the other way, Eddie. in Colorado is 1957. We have to stop to let the sheep off the road. We always love Colorado and still do. We like to go back every year if we can. Gauge Railroad in Silverton. So we went to Durango. It's a wonderful ride. There we are. the cab.
ride we go. Go for an hour ride and have lunch up in the hills while the parents stayed back and just enjoyed themselves playing cards. Hey, Billy. <laughs> There we are, there's a whole family. Peggy. in Dallas, and this is the University Park swimming pool, which was a favorite place to go in the afternoons. There we are. <laughs> Zingo. There's our diver. There's it all. There's Billy. Peggy jumps in feet first. Yow! <laughs> Looks like fun. Sunday clothes now. This is the fall of 1959. We're living now at 6825 Joyce Way in Dallas. Boy, are we dignified. There's our new Chevrolet. Close a series of Peggy doing acrobatics on the front lawn. Then we give you a snowstorm for the Christmas season. We started with Billy, and this is Peggy. This, this movie covers 15 Christmases, 1945 to 1959. A Merry Christmas to all. <laughs> <laughs> 